All right, guys, Rowdy Yates, High Plains Biochar here. We've got the continue, continue Tiki running nice and hot today. We are running right now about 780 C, so we're running nice and hot. And if you want to look up there, you can look at the emissions and just see how clean this is up against a nice blue background. That's one of the real beauties of being able to contain the emissions on the Contiki kiln is that we're able to control the temperature, bring it up to a lot higher temperature, and that in turn cleans the emissions up a lot from the, from the normal Contiki. Another one of the advantages is there's no fire danger with this situation because there's no open flames uh, compared to, you know, we've still got a lot of dry grasses and material around here as, as the snow is melting off. We're still able to burn out here because we're fully containing the flames. So there's a couple of big benefits to that, but we're gonna unload here in just a little bit and show you guys how much biochar this makes. But so far we've been making somewhere in the neighborhood of about 10 gallons per hour of biochar. Guys, we're running really hot right now. We're actually up, up over 800 C. Okay guys, we've been running for about two hours now. We've uh, shut down, the fire's up, cooling down. We're back down to 439. Now we're gonna go ahead and unload. So we've got our bin vibrator set, set on and we're gonna go ahead and kick our uh, auger on, which will start moving the biochar out the chute, and then we're gonna go ahead and kick our pump on. So here we go. Kind of wrapping up our unloading, still got a few more pieces coming out, but just wanted to give you guys an idea how this comes out. It's quenched, and it's uh, because we use a grate, we've got much smaller pieces that are a lot more usable than some of the other big chunks that would come out of a contiki that typically aren't burned all the way. So. We, we've made uh, just under 20 gallons, uh, between 15 and 20 gallons of biochar here. And we've been ready for almost two hours today. So it kind of gives you an idea about how much biochar this makes, but that's a little bit more uh, how we operate. We continue to keep from High Plains Biochar. Contact us for more information.